Hello guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to set sales prices to products and products variants on your Shopify store. Okay, let's go to the video. Okay, now I'm on Shopify dashboard, Shopify ad view. First, I will show you how to set sale price for single variant product. Okay, now you can see in the left side products, click on products. Now this is a single variant product, click on that, then scroll down. Then you can see here pricing. This is the regular price that this product sells. So now I won't set sales for, uh, price for this product. That means I want to reduce the regular price from let's say five dollars. Yes, I want to reduce this price from five dollars. So now my current uh, price will be fifteen dollars. So we need to put here our regular price we need to put our price on compare at price this is our current price that means uh, this is the highest price previous we, we, uh, we are going to add here our previous price so i will put here as 20 dollars and now my sale price is my current price is 15 dollars so this is my previous price now this is my current price that is the sale price i have already used five dollars from my previous regular price that's it also you need to keep in mind here you can see cost per item then you can see our here our selling price and our profit is calculated on this selling price not at the highest price this is our selling price our selling that means our profit or our margin is calculated on this price let's see our cost for item is ten dollars then you can see here our profit is five dollars and margin is 33.3 percent and let's see our price is fifteen dollars then you can see this price, our selling price and cost price is the same. So we don't have any profit or any margin. Keep in mind. And you can see here, customer wants see this. And customer wants see the cost for item. He's only seeing the price, selling price and our uh, compared price. That's it. And so you can see here, charge tax on this product. If you are charging tax, you can. Uh, check this box or if you don't charge this and uncheck it then click on save now let's go to our site and check it out okay here now you can see how it works it's working this is our previous regular price now this is our current price this is our sale price okay now let's see how to set sales price for multivariate products that means there are many variants for that product so let's see how to set sales price for that kind of products okay let's go again go to products this product i'm going to set sale price this product has four variants Okay, Got that. Then scroll down. Here you can see we don't have a uh, compared price or uh, that kind of uh, section to edit our to edit our price or set our sales price. So we have different methods to do that. You can see here on the top checkbox put tick on checkbox now this product had four variants now it 
has selected uh, all four variants. Now you can see here open bulk editor. Click on that. Here. Now you can see here price. This is our regular price. And you can see here compare price. This is uh, what we see in last product. So now we can set our sale product here. Okay. This is again same as previous. We need to put highest price on compare at price and our sale price as here on price now my current price is 20.75 dollars now i'm going to sell it uh, i'm going to reduce it as uh, five dollars not 15.75 dollars so let's put our regular price at uh, regular price on compared price I will show you how to put all these prices at once. Now you can see we have selected this cell. Then you can see on the left side of the cell, small uh, dot like small box, uh, small square. So when you put your cursor there, you can see small arrow. And then click on that and drag to then you can see all the cells are all the cells have been selected so now we can uh, type our price here let's say i will put 20.75 this is my regular price then now i will reduce this price my sale price is 15 dollars 0.75 then again same as click this and drag seven five that's it then click on save okay now let's go to site and check it out here now we can see it has worked this is the same this is the same price this is my previous regular price i hope you guys enjoyed the video and now you know how, how to set sales price for single variant products and multivariant products it's simple check out my channel for more shopify videos also i have given five shopify premium themes for free I have put the link on this video description you can check it out thumbs up and please subscribe my channel for more videos have a great day